Yeah, hard to believe it's already 14 years, but Rita replacing Hurricane Audrey at least is the storm of record with respect to storm surge, the biggest surge ever seen by the Louisiana coastline, where over a thousand miles of Louisiana coast was inundated by that storm surge. This is a picture, a NASA shot of southwest Louisiana before Hurricane Rita, and this is four days afterwards, and you see that darkness. We go back to the first picture and then go back to the next picture. This dark that you see is uh, generally the water that moved in and this is four days after the storm. We didn't get a good picture until four days afterwards, but that storm surge 15 to 20 feet high down by Cameron and penetrating 30 miles inland all the way to Lake Charles and inundating just about everything south of Highway 14 and Highway 90 across all of Acadiana and post Hurricane Rita. Our coastline became 30% more porous uh, because the coastal marshes were are so inundated with that water and current. And since then, we are much more prone to storm surge, and that has not changed in the last 14 years. Meanwhile, in the tropics right now, it's relatively quiet in the Gulf. We have one weather system that may head toward Mexico. Not concerned with that. Uh, we have Tropical Storm Jerry, Lorenzo. We'll talk more about that in our main weathercast. But Tropical Storm Karen has our interest peaked. It's now impacting Puerto Rico over toward the Virgin Islands. 45 mile an hour wind, some locally heavy rain rainfall here over the next day and a half and then the system moves northward and that's when the question marks develop. In fact, the storm track almost looks like a little bit of a question mark or a thought bubble here. We're not sure what's going to happen down the line, but we do think moisture is going to be forced westward. Perhaps this storm as well, perhaps toward the US down the line and into the Gulf of Mexico. So we'll have to keep an eye on that, but it's a long ways away. A lot of question marks down the line. Temperatures topping out near 90 today. We are at 86 right now and for tonight down to about 74 year low so not too bad this evening flirting with 60s in northern portions of Acadiana then tomorrow back up to near 94 a high we'll call it hottish not quite very hot but not quite just very warm uh, 90 the high tomorrow humidity though staying low coming up we'll take a look at that 10 day forecast in search of a cool front plus more on the tropics and the forecast models coming up in just a bit